Did you know that in Jumanji Welcome to the Jungle? In this 2017 remake of the popular 1995's Jumanji, the crew made their stop at Seaplane McDonough's camp. A sweet tribute to late actor and original cast member Robin Williams, who passed three years prior to the release, was paid through a sign etched into a tree that read, Alan Parrish was here. His character's name in the 1995 version. Fans upon hearing about the remake were anxious about any easter eggs, and director Jay Kasdan promised there would be many homages to the original film. Did you know that in Black Panther, Marvel's moviegoers saw the prestigious depictions of African culture and history, possibly for the first time ever in such an epic way on the big screen? Director Ryan Coogle consulted several renowned and significant consultants of African history and politics to maintain historical accuracy and political correctness. In fact, the plot's notable concept of the vibranium metal, rare and powerful enough to absorb, store, and release kinetic energy, which the enemies are after, can be compared to the real-life situation in the valuable coltan mines in Congo. Did you know that in Iron Man 3, in the comics, Iron Patriot was one of the aliases used by Spider-Man's nemesis, the Green Goblin, or Norman Osborn. However, there's nothing special about the Iron Patriot in the film. It's just repainted war machine armor adorned with Captain America's colors. Apparently, after the original 2012 Avengers movie, the government felt they needed a hero of their own. That's why it's painted red, white, and blue. And they've got a military officer, Rhodey, wearing it. Did you know that in Doctor Strange, a white mask with an onk is among the relics in the New York Sanctum? It refers to the nocturnal moon god, Konshu. Marvel lore regards him as a member of the Heliopolitan race of gods who lived in the extra-dimensional realm of celestial Heliopolis, adjacent to Earth, and was worshipped by the ancient Egyptians. Due to his inability to enter the earthly plane, he always picked a champion who would act as his avatar and obey his will. This is the origin of the superhero called the Moon Knight. Did you know that in The Batman, the latest Batman film is shattering every other box office record set in the past year and 2022 so far? The film stars Robert Pattinson, who DC and superhero fans alike were reluctant about. The trailer diminished much of the reluctance when Pattinson's Batman was portrayed as a more grittier, raw version of the superhero. Not only were fans unsure about the recast, Pattinson himself revealed he had taken a selfie of him in the suit while auditioning, in case it does not work out. It's safe to say that there's no need for any insecurity on anybody's part, as the film's already grossed $479 million worldwide in less than two weeks of release.